history has just shifted. For the very first time in history, a supersonic electric aircraft has been priced at only $75,999. Meanwhile, the average cost of a four- to six-seat electric aircraft today is still well over $1 million. This new leap comes from Tesla's bold new project called the Super Electric Plane, which has finally entered the spotlight as part of their next master plan. The Federal Aviation Administration has recently relaxed rules around private electric aircraft, and Elon Musk wasted no time jumping in. What we are seeing today is not just another announcement but a triple breakthrough that bends our idea of aviation itself. Tesla has developed a propulsion system that performs with unmatched efficiency, wings that change their shape in flight for maximum performance, and a cockpit design so futuristic that even the most experienced pilots are calling it the future of flying. Stay tuned as we reveal each hidden detail of this launch. And before we move further, I want to welcome you to Amp Drive. If you want to be one of the 1,220 insiders who get the first look at Tesla's new breakthroughs before the rest of the world, make sure you subscribe and tap that bell. What you are hearing today is not just news. It is the birth of a new era. Tesla's revolutionary propulsion system achieves efficiency numbers that were once thought impossible compared to traditional aircraft. Their electric propulsion system is the most dramatic leap in aviation since the invention of the turbojet engine. By using distributed electric propulsion combined with electromagnetic thrust vectoring, Tesla has created performance levels that completely reset what aircraft are capable of. The big difference lies in Tesla's distributed propulsion array, which has 23 separate electric motors positioned across the wings and fuselage. Unlike old aircraft that rely on one or two giant engines, this system spreads the power, generating 847 horsepower through perfectly coordinated motor operation. It also ensures redundancy far beyond what is possible with older engines. Each motor weighs only 47 pounds but produces 37 horsepower, giving a power-to-weight ratio of 0.79 horsepower per pound, compared to just 0.23 for regular piston engines. The electromagnetic thrust vectoring system delivers flight control like nothing we have seen before. Conventional airplanes steer by using control surfaces, which add drag whenever they shift. Tesla's system, on the other hand, changes the direction of thrust itself through electromagnetic field manipulation. That means zero extra drag and instant reaction times as fast as 0.007 seconds. With this, the aircraft can perform maneuvers that traditional flight physics never allowed, sustained vertical climbs, seamless vertical landings, and even zero radius turns. The power management is run by Tesla's Adaptive Energy Distribution Network, which monitors each motor 14,000 times every second and reallocates power based on flight conditions. During climbs, power is directed to vertical motors, while in cruising, it shifts toward horizontal ones to conserve energy. This dynamic optimization cuts energy use by 34% compared to fixed setups. Even more astonishing, Tesla's distributed propulsion motors act as generators during descent and landing, recovering kinetic energy and feeding it back into the battery. Test results show they can recover 127 kilowatts during a typical landing, which equals about 23 minutes of cruising energy. This not only extends flight range but also reduces battery wear by managing charging cycles more intelligently. The huge efficiency gain, often quoted as 347%, comes from how electric systems handle stored energy compared to combustion engines. Traditional aircraft engines only manage about 23-27% to efficiency, with most fuel wasted as heat. Tesla's electric system, however, converts stored battery energy to thrust at 94% efficiency, losing just 6%. When you add the energy recaptured during descent and the elimination of control surface drag, the combined system efficiency actually climbs above 100% when measured across an entire flight cycle. In practice, Tesla's propulsion system does not just power the plane, it harvests energy from the very air it moves through. Revolutionary propulsion has laid the foundation, but the wings themselves are the next great leap. Tesla's adaptive wing system is another marvel. Think of it as software for hardware in the skies. Instead of fixed wings that can only handle one compromise between lift and efficiency, Tesla's morphing wings adjust in real time. 
Inside the carbon fiber structure, 127 electromagnetic actuators reshape the wings by changing their camber, twist, and area. For takeoff, the wings flex to increase camber by nearly 9 degrees and extend surface area by 23%, generating a lift coefficient of 2.34 compared to the usual 1.67 for fixed wings. This lowers takeoff speeds to just 47 knots, compared to 67 knots for similar planes. The shorter takeoff means it needs only 1,340 feet of runway, compared to the usual 2,400, opening up access to 12,000 more airports across the world. In cruise mode, the wings shift again, reducing drag by 64% compared to the takeoff setup. This keeps lift to drag ratios at 34 to 1, while most aircraft in the same class only achieve 23 to 1. The wings are also filled with 247 pressure sensors that constantly read airflow conditions, and micro vortex generators automatically respond to turbulence even before the pilot notices. In effect, the wings can change faster than a human can react, keeping the plane stable in weather conditions that ground other aircraft. The level of precision required in making these wings is staggering. Each one contains 1,847 carbon fiber sections held together with polymers that respond to electromagnetic signals. The actuators can reshape the entire wing in just 12 thousandths of a second. With wings that adapt faster than pilots can think, the idea of fixed wings suddenly feels outdated. The cockpit design is perhaps the boldest part of all. Tesla's Neuralink interface is designed not to replace pilots, but to amplify their capabilities. It reads neural signals from the pilot's nervous system before the body even moves, sending commands instantly to the aircraft. Normal controls take about 0.23 seconds for input and response. Tesla's neural interface does the same in just 0.003 seconds. The result is aircraft control that mirrors thought itself. Information is projected directly into the pilot's vision through augmented reality. Instead of glancing at gauges and splitting focus, pilots see speed, altitude, navigation, and nearby aircraft overlaid in their natural vision. It feels as though the pilot's eyes are upgraded with built-in flight awareness. The system also predicts the pilot's next moves before they realize them, up to 3.7 seconds in advance. For example, if turbulence is ahead, the system quietly adjusts power and wing position in advance, so the aircraft feels stable. Importantly, it never overrides the pilot, but instead feels like enhanced intuition. It also monitors brain activity for signs of fatigue or stress. When overload is detected, the system takes over routine tasks, letting the pilot focus only on critical choices. In emergencies, it reacts faster than human limits allow, detecting threats up to 47 seconds before traditional systems would trigger alarms. It can process multiple failures, traffic conflicts, and weather hazards at once and guide the pilot with subtle cues that feel almost instinctive. Beyond the plane itself, Tesla is building something bigger, the atmospheric highway system. This reimagines transportation entirely by lifting it into the sky. Instead of ground congestion, Tesla proposes a three-dimensional network managed by artificial intelligence rather than centralized control towers. The system divides airspace into altitude layers of 500 feet each, stacked from 200 feet above the ground all the way up to 18,000 feet. That gives 36 different traffic corridors. Personal aircraft would use the lowest levels, commercial ones the middle levels, and long-distance transport would travel high above. Unlike current air traffic control that depends on human instructions, Tesla's sky grid allows aircraft to negotiate routes automatically with each other. The distributed AI processes millions of route combinations every second, picking paths that minimize time, reduce energy use, and avoid conflicts. If weather blocks one region, the AI reroutes instantly. This system is far cheaper to expand than highways on the ground. Building a single mile of highway costs over $4 million plus huge land and environmental costs. By contrast, Tesla's Sky Highways only need distributed charging stations every 67 miles. Each station costs about $147,000. Covering the entire United States would need 4,200 such stations, 
at a total cost of around $617 million compared to over $1.7 trillion for building ground highways with the same travel capacity. The stations themselves will not just charge but also gather wind and solar energy, helping the network stay independent from the grid in remote areas. Charging adds 400 miles of range in just 12 minutes, and Tesla's advanced battery management ensures the process extends battery life instead of shortening it. The result is transformation for cities and rural areas alike. Traffic jams become a thing of the past, with ground roads handling local distribution while atmospheric highways carry longer trips. Urban congestion could fall by nearly 70%. Parking no longer requires massive city lots, because planes can be stored remotely and summoned when needed. That frees land for homes, parks, and businesses while reducing heat from endless asphalt. Rural areas and mountain towns gain the same access as major cities, since travel depends only on straight-line distance through the air. Regions cut off by geography suddenly become accessible and economically competitive. Now think about what this really means for us, for our families, and for future generations. Affordable, zero-emission air travel where owning a personal plane could soon be as normal as driving to the store. This is no longer science fiction. This is Tesla. And what we have seen today is only the very beginning.